Davido vs Bonaboy. Let's dive into the most heated topic in the industry right now, comparing the old cat Davido and the new cat Bonaboy. You know, so we actually see who is bigger and better. Looking into their career skills and achievements, like awards, career streams, monthly listeners, and YouTube subscribers. Let's begin this face-off. So we'll start by looking into their awards. For David Doe, he has many awards for sure. He has been in the game for over a decade and listing all the awards will be so boring. He has over 60 awards to his name since he started music. He recently bagged 5 awards at the Afrima Awards. So when it comes to awards, David Doe has got a lot of it, both local and international ones. But he hasn't got a Grammy Award, don't let's forget that, neither has he got a nomination. Now looking into Bruno boy many people claimed boner boy only became active in 2018 but he has been winning awards since 2013 he won the nigeria entertainment awards for best new act of the year in 2013 won four eddies awards in 2014 including album of the year there's every fact that shows boner boy didn't just start in 2018 he's been in the game since way back and has awards to prove it boner boy also has way more than 60 awards including a grammy award and was nominated in the last edition so because of the grammys which obviously signifies he has more international recognition than david doe Bonaboy boy wins this round when talking about awards Moving on, let's look at both artists' career streams across different platforms. Starting with Davido, Davido has over 1.3 billion career streams on Spotify with over 6.7 million monthly listeners. Davido doesn't have a single track with above 100 million streams on Spotify though. The highest he has on a track is over 86 million streams on a single fall which is okay he has over 1.3 billion all-time views on youtube with 3.45 million subscribers which are very good numbers however let's check what bonaboy has starting with spotify bonaboy has over 4.2 billion career streams on spotify with over 18.8 .8 million monthly listeners you know his single last last is on over 270 million streams on spotify he has many other tracks with above 200 million streams so his numbers are obviously more than david Doe's on spotify looking into youtube now bonaboy has over 2.1 billion all-time views on youtube with 3.95 million subscribers which is also way more than what david Doe has on youtube using youtube and spotify numbers alone bonaboy is leading so when it comes to numbers of streams bonaboy wins this round so now, who writes better lyrics between David Doe and Bonaboy? Boy? Well, it's obvious and everyone knows the truth when it comes to lyrics between these two. Even the Tati BG are aware that Bonaboy's lyrics are way better than many artists in the Nigerian music scene, including David Doe. David Doe's lyrics are simply just vibes and all. His lyrics are very simple and plain, but Bonaboy's lyrics are way better and they show more talent. So so when it comes to lyrics and who writes it better between David Doe and Borna Boy, Borna Boy wins this round also and it's even an easy one at that. Let's talk about who has more international recognition. I think we are all aware that Bonaboy is known internationally than David Doe is. I mean, it is why Bonaboy got to win the Grammy Awards. It's just that Bonaboy has been able to build himself internationally than David Doe. I mean, check his collaboration with Dave called Location at over 430 million streams on Spotify. Just proves that Bonaboy has a strong hold internationally. And the success of his single, Last Last, is another sign that is accepted internationally than David Doe due to the success of the track. Bonaboy has also topped charts way more than David Doe has. I mean, he has spent longer time on the charts than David Doe. So I guess it's no bias when I say Bonaboy wins this round easily. 
so guys this concludes the battle between the old cats and the new cats apparently the new cat which is boner boy wins this all who is bigger topic because every fact shows that boner boy is bigger the only thing david who has that boner boy doesn't is a strong fan base this doesn't signify that he has more fans because boner boy obviously has more fans and the numbers are there to prove it so guys drop your thoughts in the comment section below who is bigger and better according to this comparison boner boy is bigger and even better when we're talking about music so let me see your opinion in the comment section below don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and hit the subscribe button if you like this content thank you guys for watching and i'll see you in the next video don't forget to drop your opinion in the comment section below i want to see you guys opinion also bye guys